I'm Gabriel Filippelli. I'm the Executive Director of Indiana University's Environmental Resilience Institute. Now, the world received a stunning and grim report from the Intergovernmental Panel on Climate Change in March of 2023, and that report reflected the impacts of climate change on the planet. That includes drought and flood and wildfire and hurricanes that are all climate supercharged. We know exactly what's causing the climate change, which is us, and it's the emissions of carbon uh, from our consumption of fossil fuels largely. And this report lists fossil fuels over 20 times in its summary for lawmakers. Uh, so we know how to solve the problem. We have the technology available now, but why haven't we done anything yet? Well, there's two reasons for that. One is that it's very convenient still to fill up our cars at gas stations, right? Uh, even though there are other options available. Uh, two, there's not been enough uh, action at the national or, or international scale. Until now, what we're seeing is a tremendous investment in renewables, an investment in weaning ourselves off of fossil fuel. The problem is it's not going quite fast enough. So there's a lot of work to do. And we here at Indiana University's Environmental Resilience Institute are grappling with this challenge every day. Uh, we bring communities and businesses and organizations together uh, to provide these solutions for them. They often feel like they don't have any solutions, but in fact, there really are. And in fact, we just hosted a very large sustainability and resilience conference in Indianapolis. 350 people from around the state of Indiana and beyond ranging from students to practitioners to scholars, came together uh, and worked together to share best practices, to share solutions, uh, and to inspire us for action this coming year. And this is what we need. We need action now because I care a lot about my children and my grandchildren, and we have the ability to turn the needle on climate change. And the problem is we don't have much time, so let's get going.